Appreciate it, bro. Thank you. All right. What's up, Katy, Texas? That's what I'm talking about. Hey, y'all, I got to say one thing. Y'all are an amazing group of people. I love the energy. I love the vibe. I am uh, super excited to be here and very blessed and grateful to be here. Uh, I want to just give it up uh, one more time for all these amazing speakers. Bobby, all these guys dropped some fire today. Ah, I love it. It pumps me up every time I come to these events. You know, we always go to these events all the time and, and now all it takes is one little nugget, right? So yeah, I just wanted to, I wanted to come over here and I wanted to talk to you guys today and really truly share some value. So like you said, I hope that you got your pens and papers uh, because this is us. We do, we believe in passive prospecting, right? A lot of people have come up here today talking about passive revenue and all these different things. And first things first, I got to get a, give a huge shout out to my man and my business partner, Levi Lassick, the YouTube King. This guy is absolutely amazing. I would never be able to do what we're able to do without him. So I wanted to give a huge shout out to him and the rest of our team. Now, a lot of people have been in here for real estate for a really long time. Uh, Levi and I are both actually brand new real estate agents. We got into the business uh, at the very end of 2020. And as you can see, these are our production numbers. Not very, uh, not very big, right? So in 2020, we sold zero homes and we launched our very first YouTube video December 5th of 2021. And so April, it took about 90 days to really get the channel up and rolling. It took about 90 days for us to get that first lead under contract. So we went from April, let's see, I think we're missing some, some slides here. Anyway, so we, so we launched our first, our first channel and last April, 2021, we had gotten our first two deals under, uh, under or March, we had gotten our first two deals under contract in April. We actually closed our first two deals. And since then, from April of last year till July, 2022, only 15 months, we've been able to generate almost 1700 leads. We've closed 217 transactions at a 13% conversion ratio. And as of July, we've closed over $121 million, all from YouTube. Uh, without cold calling, door knocking, spending any money on advertising, and we've made over $3.6 million in our first 18 months in the business. Now, I've, I've been in sales for a, uh, for a long time. You know, my background was a little bit of uh, marketing and advertising. That's where I actually met, you know, Chris, uh, me and him go way back. And, uh, you know, I spent millions of dollars in advertising. And I, I knew because I worked really mainly in that real estate space, what worked and what didn't work. You know, we had, uh, I'd been working really exclusively in real estate. I have done Facebook ads, Google ads, Instagram ads. I've done pretty much any type of marketing that you could possibly imagine. So getting into the real estate space, you know, I, I knew that um, this, there was another way to be able to come out here. And my goal for today and my hope is that everyone, you know, comes out of here with a different mindset and gets comfortable being uncomfortable. You know, it's funny, I, I, I don't, does anyone in here know Michael Reese? Yeah, yeah, he's a really good, he's a really good buddy of mine. He's actually a really good buddy of Levi's as well. Um, I was actually speaking at an event back in 2019, and Michael Reese was, you know, he was trying to get me in the real estate space at the time. You know, my business was doing okay. I was in the marketing space. I was, you know, probably making twenty, thirty thousand, forty thousand dollars a month, and I was like, eh, you know, I I'm good here. I'm just gonna get in marketing. He was like, dude, you gotta get out. You gotta join me in real estate. You can do all these things and like turn that inside out. And you know, it's funny because a lot of people they give up recruiting someone after like two or three reach outs Michael Reese followed up with me for many 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 years in order to uh, actually get me into the real estate space and thank God that he did now uh, that was my that was what I used to do right now I, I found that uh, doing our research because you know a, a few years ago you know I'll, I'll get into this later um, but 87% of agents, they fail in their first two years, right? It's a huge dropout rate. And one of the reasons why I didn't want to get out of marketing was because, I mean, I was making decent money, but I also knew that there was a huge failure rate. And so, and I saw how hard he worked and every other agent that I worked with in the marketing space, I saw how hard they worked in order to generate their business. And I knew that it, it was just, it was going to be a challenge. It was going to be really, really tough, but I really wanted to step aside and I wanted to do something completely different. Now, 
why do we, you gotta ask yourself, you know, why do agents fail, right? And, and most agents, they start with less than $5,000 in their pocket. So it's extremely hard, unless you're out door knocking and cold calling, that stuff absolutely works. It's very hard to get going with only $5,000 in, uh, in your pocket. And according to NAR, like you can see here, most real estate agents only make about $8,800 a year. Now, I know that's not a lot of people in this room because we have some really, really big players, but this is the truth of the matter is that so many people in real estate tr struggle because they don't have a big budget. And it's, we're in a rejection-based business. Would anyone else agree to that, right? It's a, it's a hard business. If you're cold calling, you may have to call 300 people and you're going to get a whole bunch of no's. We are in a rejection based business and they're just real estate agents typically are not very effective at lead generation. You know, one of the things that uh, my mentors taught me was it's not necessarily the best real estate agent because this time, like last year, I mean, I was still brand new. I was not, I, I did not believe that I was the best real estate agent. I've been in sales for a really long time, but I knew that it was always the best marketer who won. You know what I'm saying? How many people can you get in front of? That's going to be the best real estate agent is the best marketer. So why YouTube? Why did we decide that we wanted to go to YouTube? Well, for one, uh, we knew that all these other platforms, Facebook and Instagram had extremely low conversions, right? Because you just, you're always having to uh, build multiple campaigns and funnels and all these different things in order to do that. So when we were looking at, you know, maybe running Google and looking at YouTube, this is what we found. Plano is uh, one of the top cities uh, in the Dallas market area. And as you can see here on Google, Plano on the monthly searches gets about 90,000 monthly searches. When you look over here on YouTube, you can actually see that they have 834,000 searches for Plano, Texas. And that is, I mean, that is almost 10 times more than what you're getting on Google. So where are people at? They're searching on YouTube, right? Now, this is our, uh, this is our uh, passive prospecting uh, system here. And these are our principles. We're always intention based, right? We are very intentional with everything that we do, very different in the things that we do. And we also have a global reach, right? We have sold people in, Cali uh, uh, in, in Japan, Australia. We've had clients coming from the UK. We've had people all over the country wanting to move to Dallas, Texas. And we also believe in being act uh, attraction based, right? Instead of being the one always going out and cold calling and reaching out to people, we wanted to attract people. It's the same thing in our model with how we help other agents is we don't, we don't go and we, ch we don't chase agents down, we don't chase clients down, we really believe in attracting people through value, right? I mean, it's one of those things uh, that I believe is super important and then compounding time. This is one of the things that is the most important thing about YouTube is being able to compound your time. Now, big difference here in any other traditional marketing, this is interruption versus uh, intentional marketing, right? As you can see right here, when people are watching our YouTube channel, like most people, if they're on Facebook or they're on Instagram, you know, they're, they're looking for short-term content. They're just sitting there, they're bored, they're in the line for Chick-fil-A. They're just looking at things very, very quickly. They're not actually sitting down and taking time to research, you know, what it is that they're doing. They're just trying to pass time. And if you can look and you can see here, our average view duration on YouTube is six and a half minutes, which is absolutely huge. People are sitting down. People are mostly watching it like mobile. You can see it's actually a pretty small percentage. We have people who are 30%, 20% who are sitting down on their, on their actual computer. They're sitting down on their TV. They're actually opening up their tablets and they are taking the time to watch. Like over here on the side, our mobile views are the, the least amount of view minutes, right? So people we know for a fact that people are actually sitting down and they're actually taking the time to do research on these different areas. And that's why we have a, such a huge um, relocation company over in Dallas now is because everyone over here is taking the time to do their research, right? Now, compounding time, right? Take time versus make time. How many people in here say that YouTube just takes so much time, I don't wanna do it? Nobody? Is everyone on YouTube, right? <laughs> Like no one wants to do YouTube because that they, they, they say that it just takes too much time. But what, what happens is our 30 minutes to film one video, we, we have been able to make almost $10,000 from that one 30 minute video. And that 30 minute video, some of our, our videos that we shot last year, are st they are still gaining traction to this day. So you're able to go out there and you're able to 
create one video that lives forever. This is evergreen content. This video is going to last forever. And this is what allows us to prospect 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. It's huge. Now, again, here, 1,514 hours is 24 hours in a day. That's 63 days, right? This is how many, this is how we're able to prospect in one day this is how many watch hours we had over 1500 watch hours that's 63 days of being able to prospect so how are you going to be able to compete with us right if we are able to prospect 24 7 and we're able to get 63 days ahead from one one day you're never going to be able to keep up this is why youtube is such a powerful platform because it can market for you like uh, we were we were literally chilling on the beach a few months back and i put six deals under contract on the beach because people were reaching out to us constantly and I'd been working some of those clients and I was able to do six deals in like four days while being on the beach and being able to, you know, enjoy and relax. And I mean, this is what we, why we do what we do. All right, now active prospecting, it's hard, right? We, we all understand that it's why all sales training exists. Uh, it's a ton of rejection and it's 90% of your time. I mean, most, when I was, I've been in sales since 2010, like when I was in the car business, I mean, 90% of the time, if not 95% of the time, I was constantly uh, doing outbound. I was hustling the service drive. I was calling people like in the car business, they would literally try to fist fight you over a $200 car deal. Like they were really like that serious. So, you know, there's a, there's definitely a better way and passive prospecting. It's just so easy. If, you know, like I said, I've been in sales for so long. The, the clients that we get from YouTube are the best clients that I've ever seen. I mean, when they hop on our Zoom meetings or they give us a call, they already know who we are. Some of these clients have been watching us for six months, seven months, eight months, and they reach out to us when they're ready and they're excited. They're like, oh my God, Travis, I can't believe it's actually you. And like when Levi was doing his Zoom calls, the, the people are just so excited to be able to talk to you. And nine times out of 10, they're already ready to buy. Our average conversion is 43 days, right? From the time they reach out to the time we get them under contract, it is 43 days because it allows you to build relationships just passively, right? Always, they're, it's always building relationships. They get to see who we are. They get to know us, like us, and trust you. And then they just call us whenever they're ready. I believe that you, YouTube is definitely one of the best platforms. And here's just a couple of small examples of the emails that we actually get from our clients. Like how many people would love to have emails like this from their clients, giving them their whole life story? I mean, this is, this is every single day we're getting emails like this every single day. People who are, you know, telling us we would like to check with you if you could be able to help us move to Dallas, Texas. I look forward to hearing from you. Thank you so much for your time and look forward to hearing from you. I mean, all of these emails telling us their price range, their square footage. I mean, they might as well be giving us their blood type. I mean, they tell us absolutely everything that, that they are looking for, right? And here's our process. So I'm gonna dive in here real quick. I don't, don't have too much time, but we're, I'm gonna um, go into everything that we do very, very quickly. We're gonna cover the channel build out, the exact content that we create, lead conversion and optimization. So this is our channel, right? So on your, on your channel build out, the first thing you'll probably notice is the channel name. It's living in Dallas, Texas, right? We did not change, uh, we did not make this channel around Levi and Travis's real estate team, right? Because we're brand new agents. No one knows who we are. So why would we name our channel a name that no one is searching for? It just doesn't make sense. We let the data and the analytics tell us right through using different tools what are the number one search terms in dallas like what are people actually looking for they're looking to move and and they're looking to live in dallas texas so you have living in dallas texas and then up in the top left hand corner you can see the united states right you got the box truck moving in from california you got people moving in from new york so just subliminally we're letting people know hey we are going to help you move to the dallas area and then another very important thing is right up here let's meet in person on zoom moving to dallas texas Let's chat. A lot of people, what they do is they make the mistake of having all of their other social media platforms on there, Instagram and Facebook and all these other things. If you're doing that, one suggestion is take that stuff off. Why would you take people that you work so hard to get onto your platform and take them and drive them into Instagram or Facebook and get them completely out of their research mode? That's the last thing you wanna do. You work very hard to get them onto your channel. So this is how your channel should look right here and just making sure that you keep people on the platform. That's what YouTube wants, 
right? Now, as far as when it comes to providing value, you know, this is, this is what they were just talking about is providing the most value that you possibly can. These are some of the videos that we shoot. Uh, we, my favorite, my personal favorite, I used to be terrified of being on camera. I absolutely hated it. Um, you should have, you should definitely watch some of the earlier videos. They're embarrassing, but it's okay. I'm good now. But the vlog tours, like people really love vlog tours. We let our audience tell us what they love. We survey our audience and our subscribers and uh, so I think it was like 60% of them wanted more vlog tours. So we're going to give them more vlog tours and we do this from an iPhone. So you don't have to have a, a fancy camera or anything like that. Our first 150 videos were from an iPhone map tours. Levi come up with, came up with the map tours. I did. It was absolutely genius. We had no idea that it was going to work. All we do is we give people who are researching Dallas. We just do a share screen on Google and we say, Hey, look, if you're looking in McKinney, it's a 45 minute drive to, to, you know, to DFW airport. You got, you got Costco right here. You got all these different places and water parks and malls. And we would just show them around on a map, right? Pros and cons. Everyone does pros and cons, right? But they work. People really love seeing the good and the bad of living in your city. And then of course we would cover the top five neighborhoods. Now, when it comes, comes to search engine optimization, this is why we're able to do what we've been able to do and made millions of dollars without spending a single dollar in advertising is because of optimization. Now YouTube is a big fan of having two to 10% click through rate, right? So as you can see, this automatically split tests all of our thumbnails. Thumbnails are extremely important. It's like doing mailers or anything else. Your thumbnails are very, very, very important. It's because it's the first thing that people see in order to get them to click. So you're able to use these tools in order to split test your different thumbnails. I mean, 8% and, and they'll let you know that that's the winner, right? You see it in green, 8%, 5.3, 5.8. And, but look at over here. Look at the click-through rate. Just from changing the thumbnail, it goes up 20% better on the click-through rate, 387% better on the click-through rate. This is by the thousands on the click-through rates and 648% on the click-through rate. So spend a lot of time on your thumbnails, making them good, making them engaging, not having too many words. Like you see, we only have about three words on each one of these. That's ideally where you'd probably wanna be is just keeping the words minimum, but, get, but you know, having that curiosity because curiosity sells. Now, when it comes to lead conversion, we, um, you know, we, we have a very specific system and a very specific flow. You know, we believe that if you have to say something more than once, there's got to be a system and a process for what that is. So when we developed our CRM, everything in here is automated. From the time that they reach out, all you have to do is like, whenever we have a phone call on a Zoom, right? The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to set them up on a property alert. So we, we drop that card right over in property alerts. If they need to get connected to our lender, all this is automatic and all it puts everybody together in one we drop them in the center lender and all the automations, all the text messages, everything connects the lender and the buyer to me and everyone. And then if they're coming into town, we, we have automations and triggers that go onto our individual agents on our team uh, to let them know that their clients are coming into town. And I think that's really powerful because even if the client doesn't take the time to fill that out, they even get text messages and notifications that says, hey, don't forget to fill out this, you're coming into town email. We need to know when you're coming into town. That way it can block, we can block off time and roll out the red carpet for you. Now, another thing, we're, we're brand new, right? We have been able to, as you can see, we do, we do agent attraction with this model as well. And we've been able to start our own team in Dallas. We have 15 agents locally in Dallas, and this has been able to work. YouTube is able to work to do agent attraction. So I basically, I mean, I don't do near as much production as I used to because I'm able to give that to my team to get my team to be, you know, in a capping position to where they're all making money. Anyone on my YouTube team is going to make over $200,000 a year just from their cut on YouTube. So we're not only able to help people on our local team we're also able to use this for agent attraction and we really just started doing agent attraction about nine months ago so we have about 50 something people in the front line and 350 in our total organization so it's a very powerful platform now you know for those of y'all who have doubt right four years ago i i you know i lost absolutely everything i had a i uh, was in marketing i had a really bad business partner he was embezzling money from the company and i i, I lost everything i lost my house i lost my boat i lost my truck I lost my mind. I mean, it was, it was a really, really hard time. And, uh, I'll never forget <clears throat> four summers ago. I was, I was laying in bed the night before I was having some really, really bad thoughts. You know, I, I, I had really bad PTSD and it just, I was just going through a really hard time. And I just remember looking over and seeing my daughter in bed. And I remember saying, what the fuck are you thinking, Travis? 
get up and get to work because I, I lost, I mean, I literally lost everything. And this was just four years ago. I was living in an 1100 square foot apartment. I'm 6'3". My shower was like 5'10". So for almost a whole year, I was like having to shower and it was like three foot by three foot. It was absolutely, you know, it was absolutely miserable. But I just, I'll never forget the moment I looked over and I saw my daughter just sleeping in our bed like that. And I just said, this isn't it for me. I'm not going to go back to a nine to five. I'm not going to go back to the car business. I'm going to make this work no matter what it takes. I'm going to get my ass up and I'm going to get to work and I'm going to do whatever it takes to make that happen. Thank you. So I believe that you have to choose your heart. I believe that it's harder. I believe it's hard working out, but I believe it's even harder being sick. You know, I believe that it's hard owning a business. I think it's way harder to have a job and to work for someone else. You know, I think that it's really hard making videos, but I, I mean, it's, it's way harder making cold calls every single day. I mean, that, that for me is just a beat down. Now, out of our first year, we made $1.3 million in GCI, just basically me and Levi here, and that was off of 160 videos, right? Each one of those videos is worth $8,000. If I paid y'all $8,000 to make a video, how many people would go make a video right now? All right, all right, yeah, all right. So number two, this year, $2.6 million is what we have made so far this year off of 56 videos. Now, if I said, hey, I'll pay you $46,000, $47,000 to go make a video right now, how many people would say, hell yeah? yeah. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So you got to get out there and you got to go do this right now. I, I, I believe, you know, if you're not where you want to be, you just haven't learned something yet. We're brand new agents. We just spent a lot of time diving in, working on our craft and making this the most powerful platform for us. I also believe that you can hyper learn any subject in 60 days. You know, Levi, when he uh, first, you know, started going on YouTube, he dove in really hard for 60 days and learned everything about the platform. And that's all it took for us to understand that this is probably one of the best ways that we can go about doing our business. And I believe that if you take massive action, focus on that one thing, it can completely change your business and it can completely change your life just like it's changed ours. Now, I believe you're one decision away you know, from changing your life. And I'll, I'll leave you with this. You know, you have, you have two decisions to make from here. You can continue, if you're unhappy in your life and you're unhappy in your business, you can choose to keep doing things the same way, right? And, and nothing will ever change. Or you can go out here, you can take action, you can change your mind, you can find a plan, you can find a blueprint. And if you want to do that, you can do anything that you want, but today's the day you can change your, you can change your life. It doesn't matter when it is. You can, today can be that moment right now. So. Thank you, everyone. If you want to follow us, follow me and Levi. And, and if you want to learn about YouTube, you can scan that link right there. We're having a free training on Monday. So go ahead and scan that and we'll, uh, we'll see you all on the free training. Thanks, y'all. Appreciate it, bro.